Hey, what's good, y'all? Hey, Zalando, man, what's good, y'all, man? I know, look, it's been three weeks, okay? It's been, it's been three weeks since I just last dropped the video. My bad. I said I was gonna stay consistent. Guess what I'm not doing? Stay consistent. But anyways, I, but, and like I got another bringer for y'all, bro. This is actually a little educational purposes type of uh video. So I think y'all gonna mess with it too. Hey, but I know you see your boy be getting heavy in the gym. I know, I, I know you see that. I know you see that. It's progress. Oh, this one, the okay. Progress. You already know, but anyways, before we even start the video, though, look. I need y'all to like, subscribe, comment. We had 289. 289 subscribers, man. We need to reach 300 by the end of this year. I know we can. I know we can do it. Shoot. Shit. Hey, help me reach 1,000, but look, we're going to stay humble, though. Help me reach 300 subscribers, man. You know what I'm saying? Let's go crazy. But anyways, though, look. I used to work at Amazon for three months. Night shift. I used to work from 10, 10 p.m. To 2:10 a.m. I had a like I needed rides to work, ride back home, and then there was a time where I had a truck. But it's a, it's a lot. Of, there's a lot of stuff I got to tell y'all. So look. So I remember I signed up for Amazon around April 2021, and I, I waited like a couple weeks, and I got the job May 28th. That was my first time starting. So yeah, at first it was cool. You know what I'm saying? I first I first uh, walked inside the building. Um. You know, I sat down. I wish I had footage from the inside, but like, like, like me working. But there was heavy. There was heavy on like us recording, so it's kind of hard for me to like actually record. But anyways, um, yeah, I remember. We, I remember going upstairs. I remember going upstairs, and you know, they was helping helping us train. You know, there were, if you had some videos to watch, dude, like make you watch it. You know what I'm saying? So you know what's going on inside the warehouse. But yeah, overall, that's it was actually pretty cool though. Um, oh yeah, that sign in bonus bullshit that they they be saying. Oh, that's not true. Where is my sign up bonus? I ain't getting no sign up bonus. Ain't no fucking way, boy. Man, bro, oh, oh my God, bro. I asked, I asked this dude inside, hey, what happened to the sign up bonus? Oh, nah, they, they was just lying to get people to get hired. Ain't no fucking way, Damn. bro. You can't be playing with my emotions like that. When I see $2,500, $3,000 sign up bonus, I expect to get paid. Okay, I, I expect to get paid my sign up bonus. Okay, I, I, I expect, I expect moolah, moolah. I ain't get no moolah, you know what I'm saying? But forget all that though. No, freak, no, 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 we ain't gonna forget all that. Where my money? Jeff Bezos? Dang. But, um, but yeah, there's different, uh, like there's different, like, positions you could be doing there. Like, of course, you got, like, the high people. They be like, it's like, I guess it's like, uh, how I gotta say, operation managers, or I think that's what it's called. Like, they have, they have, like, different color vests, so you got, like, Highlighter, you have like the highlighter vest, and like there's different colors. So you got red, orange, red, orange, blue. Like I'm guessing like the red one, that's like the like the top top manager, and then you got the blue people. I said blue people, like they the Smurfs. You got the people with the the highlighter vest with the blue on it, and like those people, like I guess they they've been there for a while, and they like they know what's going on, so they help like train the like the new people. Um. I mean, you got the regular orange and yellow vest people, so that's like, you know, regular staff and all that other stuff. I mean, there's one girl that I know that worked there. I used to go to school with her. She had like a pink vest. I'm like, what's up with the pink vest? I'm guessing that's the, I guess that's the, like a regular vest, but it's pink. I'm like, shit, maybe I wanted a pink site. No, I want no damn pink vest. But anyways, though, um, damn, as y'all can see, this acne is kicking my ass. So if y'all can let me know what I can do for this acne, please let me know. But, um... But yeah, um, the different positions that they got was, um, so you had stowing, you had, um, stowing, you had wall, I think it's called, man, oh my god, I, I was just, man, I can't believe, alright, alright, so you had stowing, diverters, then you have, um, dang, bro, it's been that long, stowing, diverters, uh, there's also the position where, you know, you have, uh, you have, like, a, a staple gun, and, um, you can, like, you know, staple the uh, the label on a package, and, you know, and then you have, uh, people that be working with the carts, so, they'll get the carts out of the truck, and then they'll, like, put in a line for the people that's, uh, stolen, and put in, and, like, you know, people put in the packages on the conveyor belt for the people to, uh, you know, to, for the people to label it, so, that's cool. Um, my, from my, from, you know, from my perspective, 
the easiest job in there for me, I believe it'll be um, label. I'll, I'll be like, is labeling the packages with the little staple. I think that's the easiest job because all you like, all you doing is just standing there. Well, I was working part. I work a part time, so I was working four hours. So I was all, like, that's the easy. Just stand in there and just that's like that's all you do. That's all you doing for real, for real. Stowing, okay. They be on your. All right, so look, here's the thing inside. So they be on your head about like stow rates. So stow rates is like how much packages that we be doing like per hour, and they be making you wanted to do, you know, over and beyond doing with the stuff. I don't know how people be doing it. I ain't gonna hold you. I didn't care, really care about that. I just cared about putting where the package is supposed to go and put it in the bag. That's all you're doing. Stowing, all you're doing, you have this, you have like, you have a, you have, you have a phone and then you have a, a, a like a little la a label ring. So the label ring, it, it, you know what I'm saying? You, you, you press it, put on the, where, uh, where the uh, barcode is and then it'll tell you where in the, where in that state, where in that area that you gotta put the bag and that's all you're doing. But to me though, I don't really like that, cause look, with me when I'm working, I like music. You know what I'm saying? Music, you know what I'm saying? It keeps it keeps me pumped, it keeps me moving. But you know, I of course you could put your AirPods in. Hey, look, I ain't gonna hold it. I be having my AirPods in. Well, I have like at least one AirPod in, cause I ain't gonna. I be in that joint. I be like, shoot, hold on. let me show you. I be I be in that joint like this. Too sexy for this shit. Too sexy for your brother. Yeah, like, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I be, mm -mm. I need music to stay up, bro. They, I, I don't know, bro. But, yeah, stowing, I think that's like, I don't think that'll be the hardest. Because you, because they like, the, the manager, they will be on your head if your joint is like below what you're supposed to have. It, like, like below your stowing rate. If it's below that, they will come, really come up to you and be like, hey, you need to pick up the pace. Uh, yeah. Uh, this other position is called diverting. So basically, you're putting one package to one area of the conveyor belt. And then, like, it's different sections. And they go, you're going to be just pushing packages to where you got to go. I ain't going to hold you. I think that one's easy as well. Because, like, literally, I go, like, I, like I said before, with the AirPods, all I do is put the AirPods in one ear. And then, I'm literally just pushing packages boom that way boom a boom b that's all that's all i'm doing i think that, that one's also easy as well um uh i think the other position that people might not like because like again amazon they're gonna keep they're gonna keep you busy they're gonna keep you busy and if you don't like doing a lot of walking i ain't gonna hold you like i think the position i'm about to say is not gonna be for you it's like i forgot the position name again it's been a, i mean it ain't been a while because i stopped working in september but i don't remember the positions but you're basically getting the carts from the um, from the truck, and then you putting it in a, in a straight line for the people that's labeling, um, you know, paper on the uh, on the package. That's all you're doing. But it's a lot of work with that because also you're pushing the carts. So if you get like, if you like, you know, if you weak, you know what I'm saying, you ain't gonna be able to push the cart, with, you know, much force. And yeah, um, the other positions there as well. So, like I said, you gotta put the pack the packages in the boxes on the conveyor, but that's what you're gonna be doing with um with people labeling with the gun. Um, that job, I mean, I ain't gonna say it's hard, but if you don't got the strength and if you're not fast, oh, you're not gonna be back there for long. Cause like me, I remember the one time they had they had me work back there for the first time, and actually I was really good at it. Cause you know. We be up in the gym with it, all right? But uh, we be up in the gym with it. So, uh, like, me getting boxes and put on the conveyor belt, that, it ain't no problem for real, for real. Like, it's it really not no problem for me to do that. Not at all. But, now, they also will be on your head for that, too. Because if you're not going fast, that means the stow rate's very slow. And then, the uh, it's, everything's just slow. Okay? Er er everything's just slow. Oh! I just remembered! People labeling it again, it's called inducting. You're inducting. Oh my God, y'all, it's induct. So inducting is when you're labeling and labeling the, uh, the package. It's called inducting. Oh my God. Hey, I just remember that joint. That's tough. But yeah, inducting, though, I, that's real easy. That's real, real easy for me, though. I, I like inducting. I, I, yeah, inducting is like that. But the thing about, let me, let me tell you the pros and cons and stuff, though. So... Again, they have all these, you know, perks and stuff for the employees. So, you know, I remember during the time I was working, they was giving out free food and shirts and shoes. Let me show you one of the shirts I got. Uh, Yeah, my bed dirty. But I got one of these shirts right here. So, 
I got like a little Amazon Prime shirt. You know, this one just like likes that. Though. I like I like this shirt. Um, yeah, they be doing different events there too. Um, they be having like stuff perks, like you know, employee discounts. But but you don't get no Amazon Prime though. That's for sure. You don't get no Amazon Prime. That employee discount, you can't use it. You can't use it. You can't use. You can't. You can't use it on like. I gotta say, you can't use it on stuff. That's not shipped by Amazon from Amazon, made by Amazon. You get it? So yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty. Yeah, it's self-explanatory. So like, you can't use stuff that's not shipped by Amazon from Amazon, made by Amazon. Hopefully, I'm saying this right. Uh, hopefully, I'm saying this right. So you got to employ this guy for that. It takes like a good three dollars off of it, and then you got to pay the rest, of course. Um, you know, I mean, you know, there's a, you know, whenever you know. I ain't gonna hold you like this. Like if you ever go to the bathroom, oh, I heard that you can't go to the bathroom, but you get, you're able to go to the bathroom. Um, they got like a little vending machine area, you know, coffee if you need to stay up. Um, so you're able to take extra shifts if you want to take extra shifts. I don't recommend you take extra shifts. Let me tell you why. I, all right, so this one night I took extra shifts from my from my uh, shift, so ten to two ten. And then there's a shift where you take 2.40 to 9 o'clock in the morning. Don't do it. You're going to overwork yourself. Don't do it. Um, uh, what other? Uh, you know, there's many benefits like health insurance, dental insurance, 401k. They can help you, like, get a car. So there's different stuff that they can help you with. Um, here come the cons, though. They make you look, bro. They be, bro. They, bro. Oh they make you do up, up, up and beyond of what you are able to do. They be on your head for not doing a storm rate, and that's the fastest you can go. So they be really put. They be, they gonna really push you. Not gonna hold you. They really gonna push you to go faster, more than you can actually go. And that's one thing I didn't like. Um, the music. All right, all right this, this is this is my opinion though. But like the music, hey. They barely be any music in there, though. I ain't even gonna cap to you, bro. And, like, you know, music help people stay up. I'm like, why the hell would I want to work at a, uh, 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 not, like, I, no music in the warehouse? But how you gonna keep your, how you gonna keep your employees up? They need music to, to you know what I'm saying? <sighs> da, 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 push. You know, how they gonna do stuff? I like the music, bro. Like, ain't no music. But, Overall though, Amazon a good job. It just don't take the night shift. I, I wasn't even able to get the morning shift. I really wanted the morning shift. Like I, I'm not better work in the nighttime, and I be, I be tired as hell, bro. I be tired as, mm, I be tired of the motherfucking day, bro. Oh my god. But, but yeah. Anything else I gotta say about Amazon? Um. Oh, well, I mean Amazon cool. You know they raise up their pay rate. I don't care about that no more because I'm gone. But. It was a cool place to work at for a while to get my money up a little bit. Shit, that that place helped me get my first car, so I guess that's good too. And um, yeah, yeah, that's it though. Amazon, Amazon, cool job. But I got a new job though. I work two jobs now. I'm Mr. Two Jobs. I work two jobs now. Anyways, um, yeah, y'all, that's it. Um, y'all stay safe out there, man. And um, yeah, it's the end of the video. Hey, like, hey, look, like I said, try to stay consistent. I'm trying to find some stuff to do. I was, I, I did say I was gonna do like a squid game, but the person I was supposed to do with, they was bullshitting. So, like, what can you do? But, anyways, yo, thank y'all for watching my Age Alano album, man. Like I said, if y'all can find something to help with the acting, though, yeah, this don't look ugly. If you can find something to help with the acting, though, please put that shit in the comments, because this, 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 this face right here, bro, this, this, uh, something's wrong with it. But, anyways, yo, thank y'all for watching, man. Age Alano out, man. Later.